Okay, in this video, we will be solving this problem right here, which involves linear depreciation method. So this is our scenario. Initial FCI for a project is $50 million, the salvage value is $5 million, and the recovery period of the equipment is eight years. We want to use the linear depreciation method in order to calculate the yearly depreciation charges and the book value of the equipment per year. So let's do this. So in order to use the linear depreciation method, what we have to do is say FCI minus salvage divided by the recovery period. So FCI is 50 minus the salvage, which is 5, 5 million, 50 million, divided by the number of years, which is 8. And this would give us 5.625 million per year. And so using the linear depreciation method is very simple once you have this piece of information. And so we know the depreciation charge will be 5.625 per year. So drop an arrow down. And so we know the initial FCI was $50 million. So we say 50 million minus 5.625. And the reason we're not starting here as 50 because in year zero, that's 50. In year one, it's gonna be 50 minus the first depreciation charge. So 50 minus 5.625 will give us 44.375. And now you're simply minusing 5.625 again, and you would get 38.75. And likewise, minus 5.625, and you would get 33.125. And if you continue this, these are the answers that you will get. And a useful thing about this is that the last value will have to be our salvage value, which will have to be five. Because in the formula, you're doing like your FCI minus your salvage divided by the number of years. And so you'll end with your salvage. And if it's not, then you, I would double check, make sure your math is correct. And that's all you need to do for this problem.